Hey babes, what's up and welcome back. It's your girl Midnight Moon and today we're looking a little crazy here. I only have foundation on for this video right now because we're going to be testing out some new makeup brushes sent to me by Texamo. So these are the brushes. This is the case. So if you guys want to see the review and check out more, then just keep on watching. Make your dream come true. But let me get this straight. Don't ever need no man to tell me what to do. Today we are collaborating with Texamo brushes. And this is a Amazon branch. And before these brushes retail for $12.99. So very, very affordable. Also, if you guys see me looking off to the side, it's because I'm looking at the information for these brushes. So I can make sure I give you all the deets on these. So this is the blue set, but they also have a yellow set, a pink set, and a lighter pink set available to purchase. I went with this one, and I love the colors. They're absolutely beautiful. They're so bright, they're so bold. Perfect for Pride Month, baby. So look at this. And I do like the little logos they put on the brushes as well. There. These are really lightweight in my hand. They don't feel really bulky. The bristles are super soft, super soft, guys. We're about to go ahead and test these out. I'm not really doing a makeup tutorial today. I'm just gonna be reviewing these brushes and see how they go. And if they go well, well, these are gonna be like my new favorite. So the set came with eight brushes and the eight brushes include the fluffy powder brush, is this one right here then we have the angled contour brush which is this one I feel like this one's kind of small but honestly I like working with smaller brushes because they don't distribute the product as far out I like being able to control it better so that's a good thing about these the next one we have is a blush brush so this is the blush brush and another fluffy one. It looks almost like the powder one, just a little bit smaller. Again, same thing, very soft bristles. Also, just so you guys know, these brushes are synthetic. They're not natural hair bristles, but like I said, these are really soft. And compared to a few other synthetic brushes I have, these are like way softer than those. The next one we have is the crease blending brush which looks like this you see it has like this dome shaped top but it's the next one we have is the round eyeshadow brush so this one almost reminds me of the real techniques brush the i believe it's the crease blending brush it's like a duo set that comes with a fatter one it's this one right here actually that it reminds me of and this is the real techniques one you guys can see it's a bit more fluffy just a tad bit then we have the shader eyeshadow brush which looks like this The last two that are coming up, we have the Precise Pencil Brush, which is this one right here. I am honestly really super obsessed with this one. I love how small the brush is, and it's actually still really soft, but at the same time dense enough to not push the product all over the place. And the last brush we have is the Eyeliner Brush. I've honestly never liked eyeliner brushes like this. Um, I always tend to use angled ones uh, or skinny dotting tool brushes like you use for nail art, but you never know. This might work because it's a different brand and these feel really nice again. Same thing, they're pretty dense, they're not really moving that much, it's a short hair bristle brush. So. I did also want to talk about the case real quick, it came in this really beautiful soft case. I believe it's cotton. I'm gonna check it out for you guys. And then the inside is this silk. So it actually helps your brushes in the long run. They're not gonna 
get damaged in here. Really soft, really smooth. Also guys, just real quick, any products mentioned in this video will all be linked down in the description below. So check that out. Pepsi break. Not sponsored by the way, I just love a Pepsi. I'm Latina, so y'all know. No, let me stop. But let's get into this. So I already have put down my foundation. So we're just gonna be applying powders with these brushes. And the makeup palette that I'm gonna be using will be Gabulous Pink Glitter Eyeshadow Palette. If you guys are interested in this palette, you can get 10% off at Gabulous. Or you can also just click the link down below in my link tree. Go there and check out what else she has. But this palette is everything, guys. If you haven't checked out that video, then check it out now. Most likely, we're not gonna use all of these brushes. So we're gonna start with the crease brush. It does pick up product very well. You guys can see that. You see that? And I haven't even tapped it off yet. I love that this brush picks up the color like crazy, guys. And it blends really nice from what I see. The blend on this is really amazing though. I know I just said that, but I don't think I've ever blended this seamlessly and this quick. And if you're new to my channel, guys, just so you know, even though these products are sponsored, opinions are always 100% honest. I do not like to review something that I don't like, or if I do review it, I wanna give my honest opinion because I'm not gonna give you guys something that you're not gonna like. 12 13 dollars that's a bang for your buck baby like y'all need these in your life i'm gonna try out this pencil brush guys these brushes feel so soft Pixamo, y'all got it, y'all got it. Now I'm gonna go ahead and actually go into the shader brush. I wanna see how well this shader brush picks up the shimmers. I don't remember the name of it. So that's how it picked up. Really good, really good. Looks like it's not going anywhere. Wow, that's all I had to say was wow. Sound crazy, right guys? The color payoff with these brushes are amazing. I usually don't get this color payoff with the brushes I use and the ones I do use are from Amazon. They're the Emacs Design brushes and they're honestly really good, but these are amazing. I was never able to put shimmer on with a brush like this. I mean, guys, do you see that pigment? How it's going on? I know the pigment is due to the eyeshadow, but it's also all about the brush and how well the brush picks it up. All right, guys, so I had to transfer some stuff over to my laptop because I had no room on my phone, but we're back. And I decided to finish the other eye while we was off camera. So the last few products that we're gonna use are the Afano Cosmetics Contour and Highlight Palette. And we're also gonna be using the Maybelline Lasting Fix Setting Powder, the Makeup Obsessions Mega Honey Highlighter, as well as the Black Radiance Warm Berry Artisan Color Baked Blush. Let's go ahead and start with our setting powder. I'm going to set my face with a beauty blender and then we're gonna wipe it off with the powder brush. I'm gonna go ahead and set the under eyes. So we looking extra baked right now. We're also just gonna do the top of our forehead. Already really liking it. Again, a lot of my contour brushes are a 
slightly bigger than this and i like them but i think i really like this one better it feels soft as all the other ones do it's nice and dense so it's still putting the product on there um it's making it even so that brush went well now we're gonna go on to the blush You guys can see that in the camera right now but it definitely picked up a good amount of blush i like this i really am obsessed with these brushes right now guys and it's really because i don't think i've ever done my makeup this quick like you know we always want to spend time on our makeup to make sure it looks good and all that great stuff but when you can find tools that make your experience faster, I think that's when it really is like, wow. Okay, fluffy brush, you got it, you got it, fluffy. It's so easy. like how fluffy this is because you really can blend out with this i always like using tiny brushes like this for highlighter and just so you guys know we actually did end up using all the brushes except for the round eyeshadow brush um honestly i think this would work just as well i'm gonna go ahead and add some highlight right here i like this highlighter because it's like it blends in more to my shade like my color complexion see that highlighter it's just it's godly baby all right my loves so we are at the end of this video i have applied my mascara my uh lipstick and all that good stuff to finish off the face and we're on to final thoughts now final thoughts guys if you don't already know by how excited I was in this video these brushes are the bomb.com and y'all know I stay saying the bomb.com but these are truly amazing brushes for the price it's only $13 for one set um, they're super soft they feel very durable they have a variety of colors and all the colors are very bright and bold and beautiful the packaging is beautiful, it's well made. The thought that Texamo put into these brushes, it was absolutely insane, guys. And I just have to say, if I was to give these brushes a, a you know, star rating, it would be at like a bajillion because even my Emacs design brushes are really good, but they're not as good as these. Like my Emacs design brushes, these are my Emacs design brushes right here. This is one of the sets that I have. And you see it looks very fluffy, very soft, and it is, don't get me wrong, it is. But these, these are so much softer. They're so much fluffier. Um, and not fluffy in a bad way because you know, if they're too fluffy, they're not gonna get the product on right. But these are just perfect, 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 perfect. They come with the, the beautiful case the silk inside so you don't uh ever damage those brushes um and you can pretty much take it wherever you go because this is a pretty small case you can throw it in your bag the only thing i don't like about it is that it doesn't have like a closure so you it like you can't actually there's nothing keeping it from falling out basically is what i'm trying to say um but besides that that's a very minor 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 thing um, these brushes are amazing again guys if you want to get these just check out the link down below um everything that was in this video again will be linked down there and if you haven't yet please subscribe if you liked this video give me a big thumbs up share the video with friends because more people need to know about this brand and don't forget to comment let me know if you're running to amazon right now to check out these brushes and if you are interested in these brushes which color would you get would you get the yellow the pink the 
lighter pink or these blue ones right here let me know in the comments and we'll be back again next thursday with another video as always you guys stay beautifully awesome